Uh, here we go. What is up, awesome people on the internet? We are back for the second half of UConn versus DePaul. Uh, UConn is winning 53 to DePaul's 29. Paige Beckers is fouled. Now she has fifth on line. She's in two. 53, Yukon, 29, DePaul. All right. And we continue with the people watching fans. <laughs> oh, good pass. Good pass. Nice. That was a good pass to finish. All right, y'all. Ooh. KK slipped. All right, y'all. I am here at the game. And I am giving y'all a view as a fan of women's basketball. In the crowd, y'all going to see what I see. Sitting where I sit at. <laughs> oh, three point shot. All right, all right. I like it. I like it. I like it. Oh, JB says NC State is going down to, to Duke. Really? Wow. Okay. All right. Okay. I wonder I wonder if we can make it two minutes in this half without somebody walking past. Let's see. Oh. That was nice. That was nice. What up, Kelsey? What up, Kelsey? All right, y'all. Are y'all watching different basketball games happening right now? What games are y'all watching? Let me know. Let me know in the comments. Uh, what games are y'all watching right now? All right, we saw Iowa beat, beat uh, Illinois earlier today. We saw... LSU beat, beat Tennessee. We saw South Carolina destroy Kentucky. Looks like NC State is losing to Duke. Uh, Duke, y'all, is playing well. Duke is a young team, a very, very young team. And Kara Lawson is ensuring a that this team has a defensive identity. Uh, Duke is all about the defense. And it was about trying to figure out how you can make your offense work and trying to get your offense to be consistent. Y'all, Anaya Peoples need some help, y'all. Anaya Peoples, in my opinion, is DePaul's best player. But y'all, she has to take over this game. She has to take over this game in order for a team to actually have, to have a chance. Take her. Uh, Ranger says, I'm good for today, my game cock <laughs> Uh, JB, can you give me a, um, a score update for that NC State Duke game? Oh, air ball. Are you kind with the ball? Oh, Aaliyah with a long shot. NC State Duke. Uh, ooh, 65 55. Duke is up. Wow. Y'all, NC State going down, y'all. The number six team in the country is going down. Now 67 Duke. Wow. It's over. Wow. Y'all, what a day for women's basketball. As y'all know, I love me some upset, so that's kind of cool. Make a meal with the three point shot.
Yeah, yeah he, he just got to take over. <laughs> that was a good move, Ashton. That was a very good move from Ashton Shady. UConn is winning 60, DePaul 35. Does the does the video look a little bit clearer to y'all guys? Let me know in the comments. Man, Aaliyah Edwards is just getting it easy. And Doug Bruno, Doug Bruno upset. Doug Bruno is upset. He is very upset. Alright guys. We have Yukon 62, DePaul 35. Y'all, we we seeing we seeing uh, craziness in terms of upsets. Pretty exciting. It is pretty pretty exciting. Thank y'all for joining in. We seeing uh. Women's basketball live from a fan perspective, not necessarily the, the fanciest of cameras and the fanciest of angles, but it's like y'all here in person with me. It's like y'all here in person. We are in Chicago at Winchester Arena. Winchester Arena is where the Chicago Sky play. And of course, y'all know I had to rock uh I had to rock for for my Chicago style today. Y'all see? Y'all see I got my scat, my scat uh, sweatshirt on? Y'all see that? Of course, I got a rock for my scat. Of course. And I, I, I saw a couple of, uh, I saw a couple of scat, uh, scat clothing today. All right, y'all, they doing karaoke cam. I'm about to move this. All right, y'all. I just had to mute that because they was <laughs> they did a whole karaoke for uh, Taylor Swift. <laughs> Thank y'all for rocking with me. Yeah, of course I'm repping my sky. I always gotta rep the Chicago sky. As y'all know, that is the only team that I actually root for. I don't care who else wins. I root for the Chicago sky and the Chicago sky only. And now your peoples, what you gonna do, girl? What you gonna do, girl? Oh, nice three. Nice three. 
McElwain with a three. Now, DePaul needs a lot more of that to win this game. 62, UConn, 38, DePaul. Not likely that they have a chance. But, you know, let's hold out hope. Ice Brady. Got his script. Anaya Peoples with the defense. Oh, good take. Good take. Nice. That was good. That was very nice. Uh, yeah, guys, uh, Mama is not here today. She has to work. We were we were expecting her to uh, be here, but unfortunately, she cannot make it. Uh, oh, thanks, Lee. Thanks, Lee. I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, Matthew, the sky did make some bold moves. We have the number three pick in the WMA draft. We also have the number eight pick in the WMA draft. So it's very exciting. And yeah, I, th I think that um, we got a we got a shooting contest. If this girl wins, she gets carried to a question. Let's see. Trying to get a Taylor Swift thing. Uh oh. Uh oh. Come on, girl. <laughs> she made it. She made it. She made it. <laughs> yeah, this girl, this girl just won the uh, Taylor Swift card again. She won the card again, y'all. <laughs> Yeah, it, it has been a it has been a lot of craziness happening in Pac-12 in the basketball. Uh, Y'all, the Pac-12 is the toughest league in the country, um, and it's it's pretty crazy. It's pretty crazy how. Huh? Um. Yeah, the Pac-12 has been kind of crazy. Pac-12, they can lose a bunch of random games and still be a top seed in a country because that is just how tough, that is just how tough the Pac-12 really is. It's a tough league, y'all. Uh, Nolan says, where are your sky season tickets compared to where you are now? Um, let me try to point. I'm gonna try to point. I normally sit right over here, I'm right behind the bench area. I sit right over there. My my finger is kind of blurry, but but it's in that direction, right here, right over here. On the up, I, I'm basically uh, sit behind where where UConn is, has their bench at. That's where I, that's where I sit. Yeah, I I agree, JB. Yep, Pac-12 teams are the only ones who will be justifiably be in the top ten. Yep, yep, yeah, because the they have a lot of uh, a lot of tough games in the Pac-12. A lot of tough games, and you got an ACC is tough too. The ACC is tough also. Gilbert to the line. Made it. Is the Paul coming back in this game? Are they coming back? 62, Utah. Oh, almost got a steal. 
Ooh, oh, almost got it. They hunting for the steal. They hunting for it. Good block. Woo, woo, woo. Y'all, y'all saw that block? Y'all saw that block? That was pretty nice. That was pretty, pretty nice, y'all. Pretty, pretty nice. The ball stepping it up. They're trying to come back. Come on, Anaya. Take the game over there. She ain't gonna do it though. <laughs> I like it. Oh, she missed it. Yeah, the ball has stepped up the defense. They have really stepped up the defense. Yeah, I feel like we may have made it two minutes without somebody walking the ball. Yeah, I, th I, th I, th I think we might have made it two minutes. We might have made it two minutes before somebody walked past us. So I call that a win for for the day. Ooh, some good defense from DePaul. Let's go. Coming down the court, fast break. What y'all going to do? Come on. Almost got a turnover. Yeah, the ACC is a tough turn, tough uh, league also. It's not just the Pac-12. Yeah, the Pac-12 is tougher, but the ACC is tough too. Ooh, trying to do a spin move. Yes, there we go. Let's go, Gilbert. All right, all right. Number zero starting to take over for the ball. You got 13 points on the game, Gilbert. 13 points, Caitlin Gilbert. Okay. Y'all, she got nine rebounds, too. Caitlin Gilbert doing her thing. Y'all, is this, is this going to be DePaul's epic comeback victory against UConn? Are we about to see an upset in Chicago? Are we about to see it? <laughs> Are we about to see a step through? Uh, we about to see uh UConn come back or uh, DePaul lose to UConn. Oh, they can't hit a shot. UConn cannot hit a shot. Let's see. They got the offensive rebound. Paige Becker to the bucket. And one. Uh, their slump has finally ended. Yeah, I, th I thought we was about to see an epic comeback. But Paige Becker said no. She said, no, I'm about to score. And she made the three-point play in the hard way. All right, let's see, DePaul, what y'all going to do? All right, people with the ball going around the horn. Uh, she shouldn't have picked up a dribble. Gilbert with the ball. Back to Anaya. Number 25. Oh. <laughs> All right, all right, all right. Kate Clark with the jumper. I like it. The Paul standing in there. It's a 20-point game. I know. No, I know it's a, that's a lot, but, you know, it's not as bad as it could be. Okay. All right, Paige about to get fouled every single time. Y'all, I think we may have made another two minutes before somebody went past. Y'all, I think our luck has finally turned for the day. Our luck has finally turned, and we are in the clear. Ain't nobody walking past.
Yeah, I'm so excited. I love this turn. Let's see, DePaul, what y'all gonna do. Ooh. I like it, I like it, I like it. Macaroon with the shot. I like it. Got it off the bank. Y'all, I, I know DePaul is losing by a lot. But y'all, they, they, they got a pretty decent squad on DePaul. It's just that, you know, they're not as good as, as you call them. But they got a pretty decent squad. So, you know, put some respect on uh, DePaul's name for sure. Leah Edwards with the jumper off the bank. Y'all, the bank is open, y'all. Right? The bank is open. Ah, come on, Naya. Y'all. Trade back is the second over. <laughs> Hey, backers are taking over. Yeah, I think um I think it's possible from this for this draft. Um, and we were expecting it to be like one of the biggest, biggest uh, WNBA drafts that we've seen in a long time. But if everybody is uh, staying in college, yeah, it's going to be as, as tough of a um, it's going to be as tough of a draft as we were expecting. Number twelve, uh, Mr. Sorry. Oh, okay. All right, get back to Paul. Well, she could have said it is bad for us. <laughs> Come on, DePaul. Make your epic comeback. That was a good script. Good script. Okay. You got the ball back. I don't think that was a charge. She was still moving her feet. I don't I don't think that one should have been a charge. They called a charge on the Naya Peoples. Because Aaliyah Edwards fell. But I don't think Aaliyah Edwards feet was set though. I'm just saying. All right, Paige is out. Yeah, I agree. It wasn't a charge. Yeah, videos for life. Yep, uh, Duke got the dub. They got the upset dub against NC State. Y'all, um, Duke has been a very, very good team of late. Um, defensively, they always had stuff. You know, defensively is, is where the identity is supposed to be had. Um, that really is the vision that Carol, Coach Carol Lawson uh, sees for Duke. And now we're starting to see the maturity of the younger players on Duke. Um, and, and they're looking good, you know. This is a team that needed a lot of tests early in the season. And now I feel like they're ready to to kind of make a push when we get to the ACC tournament, um, into the NCAA tournament. Uh, I agree. Um, I I agree, uh, Officer Davis. Yeah, NC State has been inconsistent as of late. They have been inconsistent, but you know, uh, it's it's not like it's not like they're playing against scrubs. They're playing against really good teams, and they are people with a tough basket. Mm, missed the shot. All right, so yeah, it's officially a blowout, y'all. It's officially a blowout. UConn seventy six, DePaul forty nine. I was trying to speak life into the team. I was trying. I was trying to say they were gonna make an epic comeback, but y'all, it ain't happening. It ain't happening. End of the third quarter, and they get destroyed. They get absolutely destroyed. But you know, 
You know, at least we can we can watch the dance team. Let's see what the dance team got to do. Let's let's see the let's see the dance team. Let's see what Uh, well, at least, at least the Paul got a, got a pretty good deal for it. At least that's something. Oh, yeah, they got a t-shirt. They're doing a t-shirt call. I'm not going to win a t-shirt, but I'm going to try, y'all. I'm going to set up and try for a t-shirt. Let's see if they're going to throw it our way. Let's see. Can we get a t-shirt? Can we get a t-shirt? Can we get a t-shirt, y'all? Yeah, I don't think they're gonna throw it to us. Ah, uh, they ain't gonna throw it to us, y'all. What a shame! What a shame! Yeah. Every time they do one of these, uh, every time they do one of these, um, teacher talks, I never win anything. I never win anything, y'all. I never win anything. I tried. I was wearing my free hand, but they didn't give me a t-shirt. And now they go. What a shame. What a shame. I could have been a proud owner of a DePaul t-shirt. <laughs> yeah, Louisville lost. Yep, yep. Yeah, no, I agree. I wish uh, DePaul had a massive student section and band behind them. They have a band, but the student section is basically non existent, unfortunately. So, yeah. It, it's for sure, it for sure seems like it's more fans of, uh, of UConn than, uh, from the car here. All right, y'all. The call with the ball. I'm trying to, trying to be positive, guys, but this this is this is a blowout. But who knows? Maybe maybe uh. Maybe maybe the ball can go on a uh, a thirty to zero run. Who knows? <laughs> maybe they can go to, on a thirty and zero run and, and make a wonderful victory against UConn. Is it likely to happen? No, but you know, let's 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 go, DePaul. Yeah, <laughs> video for life. Yeah, DePaul is ready to go on a twenty six and zero run. <laughs> let's go, DePaul. Try your best. Try your best. <laughs> he should have shot that. Oh, good pass. Yeah, y'all, we had a really great stint of games. We had a really great stint of games. RC says, just remember Caitlin Clark is always the goat. That'll get you by. Well, what about Kate? What about Kate Clark at DePaul? What about Kate Clark? <laughs> um, Adrian says LSU won uh, the last six games. Why are they keeping them in? 
probably keeping them in the fourth seed. They should at least move up uh, to this third seed. So the reason why LSU is still a fourth seed is because of the losses, the bad losses that they had this season. Um, most importantly, importantly, that game against Auburn. And that first game against Auburn, yes, they, they redeemed themselves recently against Auburn, but um, that's not enough. I think I think that really really hurt LSU um, shooting. So yes, they're winning. They won six games in a row, but these are all six games that they should have won. So I think they're not they're not going to be rewarded for that because of that Auburn loss. If it wasn't for that, yes, they would be a three seed, maybe even a two seed. Um, I do still think they will move into a two seed, uh, especially as we see. Um, as we go into the SEC tournament, I think if uh, I think if um, LSU can make it all the way to the final game against uh, UConn, I mean, not against UConn, against South Carolina, I think we will see. Uh, ooh, nice shot! All right, let's let's go, K Clark. K Clark for twenty four points, y'all. Um, if if LSU goes against South Carolina in the SEC tournament and they have a very good game, even if they lose, I think they'll move up to the number three seed. I think they'll move up. Paige Beckers, fouled on the jumper. All right, y'all. Y'all see the score. 78-56. I'm not really sure why Paige Beckers and Aaliyah Edwards are both in at the same time. Uh, this game is over. So, you know, you run the risk of people getting hurt. So, we'll see how long Paige Beckers stays in the game. Ooh. Oh, that was nice. That was nice. Uh, Paige Jackers with the ball. All right, well, right, starting now. Let's see if we can make it two more minutes without somebody left the Let's see. Yeah. I'm, I'm surprised. I'm surprised that um, Paige Becker just said my I'm very surprised. I think that was about 45 seconds. <laughs> yeah, guys, it's going over. Paul 80. You find 80. The Paul 58. Ooh. Hayden Samuels with the three point shot. That was pretty nice. Is it just me, y'all? But does uh, Cadence Samuels remind you a little bit about a little bit of Dewana Bonner? Do y'all get a little bit of Dewana Bonner from Cadence Samuels? In her build and, and just her movements, I get like uh, I get Dewana Bonner vibes. I'm just saying. In a good way, I think that's a that's a compliment because Dewana Bonner is a baller. Straight up baller that has resigned with the Connecticut Sun. That's a bad pass. That's a bad pass. 
UConn retains the ball. Uh, Officer Davis says Tino needs to sit in. He knows UConn be having the injury bug. Yeah. He, just, he needs to sit one of them. And if you're going to pick one to sit, you need to sit Paige Becker. Because all it takes is for the land run, and it's over for the rest of the season. All right, y'all, we got six minutes left. Six minutes left in the fourth quarter. Had the ball trying to in end down the ball. You want to take it up? Take it up. Okay, hey, the ball. Good spin move. <laughs> That was pretty, y'all. Uh, that was pretty. Pretty, pretty, pretty. And, okay. And uh, DePaul has put in their bench unit. And I believe they have given up. DePaul has given up on this game. And they are taking their loss. The game is... Uh, yeah, JB says her mannerisms and length is reminiscent of bottom for sure if she can get a consistent shot. Yeah, yeah. Kaden Samuels has a lot of potential. A lot of potential. Uh, Action Shade is in for Paige Beckers. I believe that is it for Paige Beckers for the night. Got a very good game. Got a very good game. Um, Arthur Davis uh, is disappointed in NC State. Um, questioning with his uh, somebody with his motor motor. Ooh. Nice shot by Nico. Okay. Um, I didn't watch the game, so I have no thoughts on that right now. Um, but I will watch it later, and then I'll I'll share share opinions about it. Um, yeah, I, I think NC State is a team that was hot to sort of start the year, and now it's just sort of like it, it's sort of like a question of like what what's going on with this team now. I'm pointing up, so I you know. Show people directly in their face. All right. Well, while we wait during timeout, y'all can see uh, y'all can see the crowd. Oh, we got a we got a winner we got a winner of the Taylor Swift uh, of Taylor Swift Taylor Swift uh, painting the wrap it off the painting. Well, I appreciate y'all joining me though. Hey Brian, how y'all doing? How y'all doing? Yeah, please hit that like button, y'all. That would be super, super helpful. Hit that like button. Yeah, I uh, I would love to do more of these instead of going to games and, and talking to them as it as it happens. We'll probably do this quite a bit for Sky Games. Um, but yeah. Uh, don't forget to watch tomorrow's edition of Women's Basketball Weekly. Uh, 
Like, it seemed like an extended time out. At least the DePaul uh, cheer squad doing their thing. They doing their thing. They can't get killed, but they they still trying to bring the cheer. They still trying to they still trying to bring the cheer. Uh, video squad says, Peter, you're on mute. I am. Can y'all hear me? Can you let me in the chat? Let me know in the chat if y'all can hear me. It's fine that I'm off mute, so I don't know. Somebody let me, let me know in the chat if y'all can hear me. Oh, okay, y'all can hear me, okay. Yeah, the Paul, uh, the Paul cheerleaders, they're doing their thing. Trying to bring some, uh, pep to this game. That is over. <laughs> it has been over for a while. But you never know. Maybe this next five minutes, the Paul is going to go on a, uh, epic, uh, 40 and 0 run in five minutes. You never know, guys. Keep, keep up, hope. Keep up, hope. <laughs> All right, the ball with the ball. Yeah. Well, they trying. They just failing. They trying, but they failing. You know what they say, guys. Keep hope alive. Keep hope alive. Oh, that's a good defense. Okay. Good defense. Here you kind ball. I'm gonna leave one of those. Okay, to ice. Oh, good pass. I mean, that was to Cadence. <laughs> to ice. Now to KK. KK with the AM one. Who winning? I mean, Yukon. Yukon is just showing the pass. 95 to 58. 95-58, we are in the fourth quarter. There's 418 left to go in the game. Take it on into the free throw line. Trying to get her a three point play, but she just made it. She made it. All right, come on, DePaul. That's a good pass. Oh, straight in the arms of KK. <laughs> Y'all, I can't actually see how many turnovers uh, because. I got, I got the, I'm doing a game on my phone, but y'all, the Paul has to have a ton of turnovers in this game. It is crazy. And UConn has capitalized on just about every single turnover. But y'all, uh, we still got some, some DePaul fans still trying to cheer on the team. Still trying to cheer on the team. All right, get into the free throw line. Yeah, JB, uh, the 30 point blowout prediction turned out to be generous. Yep, yep. And last year, uh, UConn, uh, like DePaul was actually, you know, had some pretty good games against UConn last year. And that was because you had both Amaya Peoples and you had, um, I need some more doing that thing. 17 turnovers for the ball. That is crazy. Um, and UConn has 13 steals in the game. 13 steals for, for UConn and 17 turnovers for uh, the ball. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Ooh. Nice take to the basket. Okay. Yeah, JB Rogers too. Yep, yep. She was good. She was really good for uh, for the Paul last year as well. Absolutely. Now, 
DePaul would be in such a different spot if both Yagi and Anissa stayed on the team. They would be so much better than they are right now. But you know, you can't you can't blame you can't blame a top player for leaving and going somewhere else where they'll get more notoriety. You know. Like I get it. They're very good on DePaul. Uh, but DePaul, you know, DePaul ain't going away in terms of actually making some noise in the NCAA. And so I understand why Rogers decided to leave. I understand why Moore decided to leave. Oh, the Barry is in the game. I think it's our first time in the game today. Amari DeBerry. Yeah, and maybe, yeah, it's, it's 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 possible that they could have made it to the tournament, but if you're if you're players of that caliber, I think you don't take the gamble. I think you do not take the gamble. Um and that's why they left. Which I understand. I understand. But it just sucks for the fall of future basketball because yeah, they're a small market team. So it's hard to imagine top players uh, staying in the team for the room. They're leaving us in the rest. Ooh. Amari DeBerry with the block, y'all. DeBerry got herself a block in this game. She came in a game in about a minute. She got a block. All right, DeBerry with the ball. That was a good, good jump pass to Ice. Ice was held and is going to the free throw line. Ice pretty shooting too. Come on, come on, JD. Come on, JD. <laughs> um, guys, we are at 102 versus 51 points. Wow. Absolute blowout. Absolute blowout. I'm not trying to be shady, baby. Come on. Really, baby? <laughs> All right, y'all. We got a minute and 20 seconds left to go in this game. I like the hustle, though. Let's do hustling. All right. Ice fell down again. Oh! Let's go. All right. That was a good three point shot. Got it. I don't think that was a foul, but okay. <laughs> Videos for life, really? Videos for life say maybe if the ball can only move by 40, maybe it'll be a more victory. <laughs> Oh, man. Yeah. Austin Davis, you're right. Yep. This is, uh, this show is looking like the South Carolina versus Kentucky game. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. But you know what? The Paul still got some fans out here. 
There's some people still cheering for him. I, I, I hear him. Yeah, they still hustling out here. They still hustling. They still trying their best, y'all. With 30, 30 seconds left to go in the game. They're still playing. UConn ball. We better just run the clock out. Likely. All right, guys. Final score. UConn 104 to DePaul 67. As we count down the final parts of the game. I do appreciate y'all for rocking with me and, and, and checking, out, checking out the live stream. I appreciate it. I appreciate it, y'all. Y'all have a fantastic night. I will talk to y'all tomorrow. Uh, please subscribe if y'all have not subscribed and like this video if you haven't liked it already. Until next time, guys. Bye-bye.